In this video, I'll be showing you how you can do a linear regression in Excel, both through creating a graph and also through using some important functions in Excel. So we have our X and Y data points here. So let's start by making our graph. So let's insert, click this, scatter plot, and select data. Let's name this graph as linear regression graph. Let's input our X values here and input our y values here. All right, so let's plot the graph. We get this scatter plot. And let's add labels to our axes. So let's have a primary horizontal and a primary vertical. And let's call this x axis. And let's call this y axis. All right. So with that, we can add a trend line to our graph by clicking any of these points here, then right clicking that point and clicking add trend line. With this, we're going to be given our trend line here, which is a linear trend line. And to get this equation, we can just click display equation on chart. And for the R squared value, click this. So we get the equation and the R squared value. Now we can do the same thing here without creating any graph and by using some functions in, in Excel. And so first we can do correlation. So write this down correlate correlation here. And choosing our data. So here, drag this, and then um, do this here, a semicolon, and depending on your Excel, it may be a comma, but here it's a semicolon, so let's do it for the Y values, and we get our R value. And to get our R squared value, you can just do this, raise to two, right? Because R is this, and R squared is just, well, r times r right or r squared so it's 0 0.963 and if you look here it's the same thing so the slope is just equals to slope and it asks us to input our y values first so known y's then input our known x's so enter and we get the same value as well which is 0 0.4285 as our slope here and for the intercept it's just equals to enter Step. click that and again input your known y's first and then your known x's enter and you get the intercept value which is 2.333 and here it is 2.333 so you can just get this data and create your y equals mx plus b equation right so y equals to m which in this case is a slope so 0 0.428 x plus plus B, our intercept, which is 2.333. So that is the equation for the linear regression, which is the same as the graph. So that's it for this video. If you have any questions, you can always ask me in the comment section below. Thank you.